afternoon, gents. Welcome to week five on uh, this lovely Saturday afternoon in the back garden. Uh, I'm sure I know where you'd rather be this afternoon, out on the links. Uh, what a beautiful day it would be. But uh, this is the best we can make of it at the moment, sadly. So uh, I hope you're all keeping well and doing fine at home. And hopefully we're starting to see some signs of maybe a little bit of action in a couple of weeks time out in the golf course. So the shot I'm going to cover this week is a little rescue wood uh, around the green for a, a, like a kind of a chip shot. Um, sometimes you, you don't want to put this. The default with a lot of you is to take your putter up when you're around, around the greens and that's fine if it's flat. But if you've got a green that's well above you or um, there's a lot of hills and hollows, um, it, can, it can be a little bit tricky. So missing the green on the likes of the, the eighth hole on the left is probably the most of the slope you're going to have to face and it can be good for that kind of shot but even something a little bit more more subtle like just being off the edges of the greens with all our contours that we have so something like this but probably a little bit more you might want to chip off the bare lie the difference between using your rescue wood and the putter is this will get the ball going much quicker up over the slope it will give the ball an awful lot more momentum and it's simply down to the loft your putter has only got kind of four or five degrees of loft your rescue wood will generally have anything from 18 to 22 degrees. You'll see it on the TV, players even do this with a, uh, a three wood. So literally I have, how we're going to do with this shot is just treat it like a little putt. And the most important thing is you should always feel like you're hitting it the same as, as, a, as a putt. Same speed, same kind of swing. Uh, I'm about whatever 25 feet from the hole here. And really going to have a nice narrow stance. I'm going to use my putting grip. I prefer to use a, use a putting grip when I'm doing this. And literally, I'm just going to make a swing like a like a putting stroke, something like that. And it's quite a safe shot. Okay. You can see the ball gets rolling quite well, and it's uh, nothing too complicated. But the big difference is the loft of your hybrid gets the ball up and over this much better than your putter will. And the most important thing is you don't have to really think too differently as to as if you were putting, so you're using a similar kind of, of stroke, which is why I like to use the, the same putting grip as well. Okay. So you can see the ball kind of stays, sticks to the ground much better, but runs up and over. Uh, rather than your putter maybe kind of jumping and getting stuck in the mound. So again, you know, I know you can't probably practice this shot at home at the moment, but you know, bear in mind next time you're out in the links, takes a little bit of practice, so you've definitely got to give it a, a, a go before you, you try it in the, in the competition or something. But it is, uh, it is a good shot saver around the greens. Uh, certainly if there's a flat surface, stick to your putter. But when there's a lot of hills and hollows involved, give this a go. Okay, hope you're well and we hope to see you in a few weeks.